We have made our way inside Joe Gibbs Motorsports. Just like Penske, everybody here is always super nice, super friendly. We got to talking about Fan Fest. And I'll give you guys a scoop on Fan Fest. It is this Friday. It is not here at Joe Gibbs Motorsports. It's not here at Joe Gibbs Racing. It is at the Charlotte Motor Speedway. So if you plan on coming out to Fan Fest, do not come out here to Joe Gibbs Racing. There will be nothing here. Everybody's gonna be at the Charlotte Motor Speedway. It starts at 4.30 p.m. You can get your wristbands at 4 p.m. There's gonna be an information tent set up. You can get your wristbands. The first 100 wristbands to be given out will be the ones that can do Fan Fest and get those autographs. But they've been getting a lot of phone calls here about why the Fan Fest is not gonna be here at Joe Gibbs Racing. And they said, well, there's a lot going on at Charlotte Motor Speedway and they wanna keep it that way. They wanna add the Joe Gibbs Fan Fest there this year. I think it's really cool. They're gonna be having Stunt demonstrations, like I said, Brett Michaels concert will follow the Joe Gibbs Fan Fest. I plan on being there all day, so hopefully if you're there, look me up. I will be wearing my Ricky Bobby Wonder Bread NASCAR shirt and hat. Won't be too hard to miss. Hope to see you there. But between now and Friday, we are going to hit some race shops. We're going to hit Lancaster's Barbecue. So we're definitely got us a week fun-filled events in store. Hope you join us for the adventures. Wait a minute. There I am. What's up, people? Thanks for watching. Shout out to my lifelong best friend, Tom, who's a diehard Redskins fan. He's uh, battling some health issues right now. He's hanging on almost for dear life. So if you pray, keep him in your thoughts and prayers. Hang in there, Tom. You'll get through this. He somehow survived the Washington Commanders getting their butts handed to them by the Dallas Cowboys yesterday. But I'm a Carolina Panther fan and I don't have much room to, to talk. That was an ugly game. And since we are here at Joe Gibbs, let's go ahead and take a look around. And as we start, we start with Rowdy, Kyle Busch. Check out that beautiful Daytona 500 trophy. FedEx number 11, Denny Hamlin. Coach Gibbs is out here talking on the TV. They're right in that door right there having lunch right now. We are not gonna bother them.
Christopher Bell. O'Reilly 253. Old J.D. Gibbs photo there. MBNA 18. Plaque for J.D. Gibbs, 1969 to 2019. More trophies, there's some shoes. Check out those cool shoes. Now oh, those are pretty cool. So Kyle Busch Motorsports was not very busy, but I'll tell you, Joe Gibbs Racing is getting quite busy right now. One more quick shot of some more trophies and hats and boots and got some folks here from Texas visiting. They just flew in from the Talladega race yesterday. Visiting this area for the next couple of days before they head back <laughs> to Texas. Bobby Labonte. Interstate number 18. I'll be hanging out with one of those Labonte boys next week, as a matter of fact. One of my corporate events. If I can find the photo that I took with him last year, I'll post it with the video. But if not, I'll have some updated photos from this year posted from our event. Another look there inside Bobby Labonte's ride. So as we get ready to depart Joe Gibbs Racing, just a quick view of the outskirts of the building here. We had some pit crew guys going in from lunch. Beautiful campus they have here in Huntersville. There's a quick view of the upstairs. The corporate offices, that's where the coach and the drivers have their offices. They're slowly starting to come back from lunch, so figured I'd just kind of peek my head back in here, see what's going on, if anything, but don't look like it, not yet anyway. Oh, 
is a bird flying inside the reshop. So we're back outside, just taking a walk around, showing you this beautiful campus that they do have here. Pretty much lunch is finishing up. Everybody's starting to come back in. So figured I'd come out, walk around, see what's going on. As always, see what we can get into. If you've watched my other two videos that I've posted today, we were at Penske Racing this morning emergency exit only get a chance watch Penske we were also at Kyle Busch Motorsports how you doing that poor fella had his arm in a sling hope he's gonna be okay how you doing good Now their pit crew training, Joe Gibbs has got set up similar to a football field. There's a glass door there, part of their shop. But they got a little practice football field set up over here on the fence. And you can see right there, one of the cars there I don't know if they're doing any type of practice for pit road today, but uh, we'll take a look and see. There's what I was talking about, the football field that the coach has designed for the pit crew, or I guess anybody else, anybody else that want to get out here, do some calisthenics. But right here is where they do their pit crew practice. It is Monday, so typically they don't come out here and do much on Mondays. Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and sometimes Thursdays, you can catch them out here. They don't mind you watching, but when they're practicing here, they don't want you recording it. That's why we've never showed it. Everybody coming back from lunch. Maybe I need to go have lunch. What do you think? Oh. All right, we are backstage at Joe Gibbs Racing right now. Take a look around. Everybody's coming back from lunch. So not a whole lot going on back here, that's for sure. No. Not much going on back here at all. But there's where they practice pit road. Let's see if we can get out of the gate. Hmm. 